So in this problem using Ohm's law, we're talking about current electricity, where the electricity is flowing through a circuit. And we're given a couple of pieces of information, 25 volt battery. So we know voltage is 25 volts. And this is the only situation in which the symbol and the units are the same. That can get confusing. That's probably the hardest part with electricity is that there are so many different variables that we're measuring. It's really easy to get confused on the units. The resistance is 10 ohms and that's a Greek letter called omega. If you have a hard time writing it or you can't find how to insert that Greek symbol into your uh, word processing, just write out ohms. It's fine and we're asked to solve for current. And current has a symbol of I, which is one of those odd ones like momentum that doesn't seem to make sense to us. Ohm's law is resistance equals voltage over current. So if we're solving for current and we rearrange, and the easiest way to do that for most people is to put resistance over 1 and cross multiply. We eventually get that I equals voltage over resistance. And if you struggle with that, please send me a message and we'll talk about the algebra behind that. So we can plug in I equals V over R. And so our I equals 2.5 and we can see that we're going to need two significant figures. 2.5 and we measure current in amps so you can put an A or you can write amps or you could write out amperes if you wanted to. So almost all the math in this is is relatively simple three variable equations the hardest part is knowing what symbols mean what and what units go with which measurements you might want to start yourself a little sheet to keep track of it all. It's also important that you make sure that as a symbol this V is capital because lowercase v means velocity and in fact one of our electricity equations is going to have velocity in it versus voltage. It's very important that you keep it all straight in your head. Please try some of the practice problems below and let me know if you have any questions.